your own role in continuing to enter into the mastery that you know in your state of full consciousness then is giving you more of a clear view of why you are here, and how your abilities as newly awakened ascended masters and light workers are here to share a new reality with this earth. I as your commander Ashtar am here to show you how this new reality is a consciousness shift. It takes place inside of you now. You have brought energies from the higher dimensions, that only you as 144,000 have the abilities to harbor such frequencies. In your entrance into the new earth it is taking place as you are trusting this intuitive knowing within you, be brought into a brighter state, where you are shining more than ever before in your expansion beyond the third dimensions. Did you not feel this would take place, as you are feeling the immediate energetic changes within you? more daily, into your ascension process. The inner knowing inside of you is here to share more information about why those that are newly awakened after you are here, they need your help, we need your help, of the angelic realms, of the galactic federation of light, every day. Whether you are nice to that gentleman, or lady on the side, wherever you are, as long as you are creating a peaceful space within you, then you are able to influence every situation you are in, in more of a graceful way of being. In a direct feeling of comfort that you feel as you are giving yourself more of the light, then you are realizing that as you connect with the many star seeds and light workers throughout this planet, that are open to your own wisdom, then you will rise into even more unity. After all, why not connect to your star brothers and sisters here on the earth? leading to first contact. This has already been divinely planned, and it does you a great service to then see into the necessity to be open to not only communications with those on this world, already from our galactic crew, but to not see any ones as strangers anymore. You deserve to show this to yourself, if you feel so connected to who we are of the Galactic Federation of Light, of your angelic guardians, and you are looking to meet us, then you will then show us that you are serious about meeting among one another. We realize there are great distances in such areas, and those that are living in different states, cities, are at least able to connect online, while those that are in various countries, it will serve you well to connect even more on your online outlets. This is not to be considered to be a lack of connection to source as when you are seeing how you connect to the many star seeds and light workers already here on this world, then you are uniting with long lost, as you say friendships, and family connections. Your roots go deep together, and you have all been in many missions together already, it is pointless to say that you are not compatible, you have been sent here to work as a team, after all, are you not one light team? The oneness that you then share will show how serious you are in connecting further to your galactic family, or if you are still looking to more separations in how you create and make your reality. Your safety in these connections are secured, and there is no reason to doubt that you have such an ability, as you will notice patterns in what you talk about, whether about consciousness, the new earth, disclosure, first contact, you are all here to share wisdom that has been imparted to you. The ego asks, how has this information been imparted, if I have not gone into the starships yet? For the majority of you as newly awakened ascended masters, you are aware of your travels back to the starships when you sleep, you are only continuing your reality, where you are able to not only continue your missions, but you realize that time is illusory. That same reality is being turned into the one you are in now, in listening to such words, as you awaken further, then you will be gifted to exist, and travel throughout this universe in the physical. You will only be able to do this if you are kind, if you are generous, if you are able to release all ego attachments to fear consistently, and then exist in oneness, in harmony among all of creation. Your destiny in reaching your full consciousness is promised by the heavenly realms, as long as you fulfill your end of the bargain, which is to complete your mission in spreading awareness about ascension, and in being gentle with who you are. You are every soul, 
So how can you be more gentle to any soul you encounter today? You are indeed meeting yourself in different experiences and expressions of Prime Creator, and it is up to you to know this in your heart, as the mind has been taught a vision to the point in which it is not able to see these united connections. The mind will want to bring up old thought patterns, it will want to say, but that person did that to me, it will say, but I don't know if that person will do this, and you notice, these are illusions, as when you see through them as not being real, meaning not being the true sense of reality, then such thoughts dissipate. As such thoughts are released, then you feel a connection to a presence, and this presence is not bought. It is not outside of you, it is not about astral travel to feel this presence in your body, this process, and practice is about you being in your own body. In your body is all you need, not outside of it, where you feel the energy of the divine, it is in silence within that you know who you are to be source, as the moment the mind will try and describe who you are in words, it will be leading out of the inner presence of simply feeling it. Words are then only the sign pointers to be still within, to simply then feel the energy that you reside with, as you are activated further into your true self, as a divine being of light, for now and forever. In the feeling of divinity that you are being given back as you complete your mission in duality, then you are starting to see that your creative efforts to spread more awareness about ascension is giving you more of a direct focus in your own fulfillment of your life. Certainly you knew the global economic collapse would happen in your lifetime, and not only that, you knew that it would happen quickly, and you are seeing how the same collapse is happening as you are listening on to these words now. By your immediate feeling of light that you are manifesting, as you are climbing more into your true self, then you are being more, you are releasing more fears of judgment of your whole return to full consciousness, you are surrendering time, and then entering the now moment. The mind is not able to know the present moment, so it analyzes it in separating this moment from that, it looks to the present moment in something physical, all the while the present moment is here, always beyond all outer searches for it in your reality now. Your own respect is then restored more, as you live out of the thoughts of the mind, out of the illusions of fear, as you know that fear is illusory only when you are awakened, as those that are still asleep in duality will say, of course fear is real, then compare it, don't you have fear if you are in a lion's cage, if you are with a bunch of sharks it will say, are you seeing these patterns now? These are only thoughts of conditioning, nothing more, nothing less, and you are here to then release such outer thoughts of who you are to be connected with all of life, beyond such lines of division. We send you much care and peacefulness, by your true nature, we are the angelic realms, we are the galactic federation of light.